All right, then, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Resident Evil Number Two. Oh, wait. Okay, I thought I saw <laughs> now Resident Evil Village, aka number eight. I thought I saw somebody freaking go on cross right there, but that was just a reflection of some sort. So anyways, we're stuck in an escape room now, and all our stuff has been taken away, and we're at the dollhouse, pretty much. Mia, no, this is how she died. Oh, I mean, a doll of Mia. Why do they have a photo of her like that? A crest on them, just like a photo like that. Am I supposed to know? How she died? Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember, man. The doll had one of our daughter's pieces, and we tried to get it, but obviously, he wasn't dead, dude. That thing's alive. And the bandages are, are too tough. I need somebody to cut them. Okay. How about this? There's a ring. Remove ring. Well, okay, I thought I wasn't gonna be able to. I'm just saying, do I need something? Blood covered ring. What am I supposed to do? Examine the arm. Remove arm. Oh, I thought we were supposed to copy, like how she died. Yeah, three eyes right here. Symbol of some sorts. Okay. What about this thing? Examine right shoulder. Remove. Oh, there's something right there. A key. Silver key. What's up? Whoa. That's a key. Can you believe it? She's she's so energetic. It's crazy. Hmm. They've been spying on us. Wow. Has Chris Redfield and I been spying on us and then they just freaking took in silver keys for this thing. And we're in a lab. Nice. Wash my hands. Oh, hold on. And clean the ring. Okay. And we're washing your hands at the same time. Wedding ring. Is this Mia's? I don't know. There's something. Ah, there's a code. 05 11 Hey, hold on. Not from the other side. Zero five twenty nine eleven. Double check. That's where the freaking lock picks would be usually. Okay, eleven. Go. Oh. All right. Not bad of an escape room. Hopefully you're not like Lucas and just make everything rigged. You know. Why would I want to be out here? <laughs> Alright, let's go, man. So, you're just gonna open up that door for me? Oh, I've never been in here. Hmm. Because this door was locked before. A boop. Hold on. A memento of my time with Ethan, but this music box no longer plays. This is gonna be. Are you serious? We're gonna have to hide. I hate f <laughs> hiding games, bro. Hiding so annoying. You have to run away. <laughs> Can't do nothing about it. Just had to hide. Ah. Hang is out here. Well, what am I supposed to use then? Why's it get so quieter now? Now f open the door. Get the door open. Don't close it. Yeah, of course you're gonna close. Okay. Well, looks like this isn't gonna work. Hmm, that's obviously not gonna do anything. This door was locked before. Why would there be noise there? Oh no, this door wasn't locked before. So it's always open. Our happy family, number one. Rose's best friend in the whole wide world. She really likes this fairy tale. Most important thing in the world to us. A wedding gift from grandma. Proof to of Ethan's everlasting love for me. Well, I guess we're gonna be playing this tape then. Nope, I don't have a T. Change symbol. Ah. Well, how am I supposed to know? There's the three eyes. Okay. Alright, we can take the freaking eyes now. It needs to be from this side. Okay. Examine left eye. 
Uh, a bird looking to the right. Examine this mouth. Bird looking to the right. There's something. You need some kind of tool to get it. And so examine this. The leg. Nothing there. All right here. Remove leg. Got a key. Winding key. Okay. We need that for the dancing. All cylinders. Oh boy. I'm not gonna be good at this. Wait, one place. Something's not right. I think I might know. There's scratches on this. So you just need to do that. Maybe like this, actually? This might be it. Yeah, we got it. We got a tweezers out of that. Hopefully we know how to hide yet. We got three hiding spots. Two inside of here and then one inside the lab. Let's go ahead and get this image or whatever. Oh wait, it's a film strip, is it? Oh yeah, I know about that. It'd be a film strip. It is a film strip. What's happening? What's next? You see, this is the f one problem, man. Is that you don't f trust me. You don't tell me sh Okay, you need to start telling me every- Alright, all you say is, Ethan, but you don't understand. And then you just f run away like the on, dude. I'm the one that you should trust the most. Ain't that right, Mia? Like, come on. You need to trust me. I mean, I didn't trust you at the beginning, but I still chose you. At the end of Resident Evil 7, so yeah. That's gotta be something, right? Aaron, gotta tell you something. My love for you. It's just impeccable. Oh, we already know what we have to do. Oh, what the f? Are you serious? I'm guessing is what we did first. So, we did that first. Do this first. And then, like that. Play movie. Maybe that's it. Are you serious? A few moments later. Rose's best friend in the whole wide world. Ah, this is now this makes sense. A gift. Is it like that? Yep, we got it. Hopefully. What's happening? What is this film about? Got a well. What does Mia not want to tell me about? What did you find me in? Cause I seen Kristen and like you. Not in the BSA numbers did. It You open the door. Ah, oh, okay. Are you watching me? They were definitely watching me. Alright, so they went inside a well. Hopefully none of these dolls come to life. Scissors! What are scissors gonna be used for? Am I gonna cut open something? There's no way. Ah! I see. I thought this was freaking wood. <laughs> I did not know it was bandages, bro. Are we gonna be cutting Mia now? Why is there a phone? Zoe? Are you in the other line? What's up? <laughs> Nothing. Of course, man, of course. Now you want to ring it up. Please, Ethan. Listen to me. I didn't want to keep it from you. Mia? I didn't want to lose you again. I didn't want to destroy this family. Mia, what are you talking about? I love you both so much. I had to. I had to do it. Do what, Mia? Always you. You're always filled with trouble. And it looks like something can fit. Yeah, we need a baby thingy. Oh, well, this is... Got it. Gosh. Mia, hold on, bitch! Get through. 
me up. Hey. Okay. I mean, hey, yeah, what the hell? <laughs> Bro, I'd be missing these jump scares, man. <laughs> I just accidentally activate them every time. This is gonna be that thing that we need the final piece. Brass medallion. Okay. Tell me, are you being controlled by Evelyn or what's going on? You're definitely still immortal or whatever. Perfect. I have a flashlight. Interest. Well, I can't be waiting. I can't wait to be running, you know? This is gonna be fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, this is the well. Nothing hanging. And that's that. Alright, what is it? What's down here? What am I gonna find? Bum, bum, bum. Breaker box key. And then body parts. Of Mia? Oh, tell me. Did they lock me in here? Rose, where you at? Rose, is that actually you? Rose, that's definitely not Rose. It's false. Rose isn't here. Remember, she was turned into a crystal. We need to revive her. I tell me the doll was alive this whole time. God damn, I hate this. That'll be fine. I don't think it's gonna be fine. What did I grab by the way? I got a key, right? <laughs> you know, this is a type of horror game I be wanting to play. Now, it's scary. Sort of. Am I supposed to run backwards? I thought I was gonna go inside of there and hide, but I guess not. The f can I open this door at least? Perfect. Do I need to hide right now? Don't know. Crouch. Hello, dolls. Hopefully you don't get my position. Oh, what the f Who fell? Okay. Okay, well. Can't be this easy, right? You got it. Is it coming? Yeah, it's definitely coming through there, right? Or is it in the hallway? Oh, it's in the freaking doorway that I need to go to, so... Let's just go like this. I mean... If it's gonna be slow... It's not like it's gonna matter right now. Okay. Baby! Open the f door, let me in. Close the door. Close the door. Close the door. Okay. That it? I know there was hiding spots, but like... It wasn't really on me, on me, you know? So I didn't really have to hide. Definitely could have, but... The amount of time that would have taken. 
No worries, it's taking forever for me to figure out done all that. Is that a mage's W king? Yeah. Alright, well, they wasted their opportunity on that. Ah, oh, f*** me. <laughs> never mind, never mind, never mind. They didn't waste their opportunity at all, Brendan. Alright. Do I want to be at the bottom or do I want to be up top? Yes, he's sh**. Uh, only one way to find out. Hello? Don't mind me. Ah, ah, ah. Now I have to hide. I don't think it's a good idea to hide under, brother. I'm just saying. Because surely he's gonna see me, right? Do not press W, because if I press W, that motherfucker is gonna open the door. <laughs> Hey, I ain't your day. Yeah, let me just stay right here. Oh my gosh, where did I go? I can see a little bit of you. I should be fine, right? Um, I should be fine. Hopefully. I mean, you can probably push doors, but can you pull the doors? Yeah, under the bed is too obvious. I mean, all of these lightning spots are too obvious. Sure, I could have just crawled under as well. And just like gone around it in the hallway. Wait. Where the f*** is the fuse box I'm supposed to put this in? I don't know where that sh is. Do you guys know where that is? Because I don't. Hold on. Is it going to be in there? Maybe. Only one way to find out, I guess. Hey, whatever you do, Ethan, do not slip, brother. Because that would be bad if he's just, <laughs> you know, up and at him on the floor. I can go to the... Nope, I can't go to the right. I'm forced to go this way. So now I'm forced to hide. Instead of just W key all the way. It's definitely gonna spawn in front of me for sure. It's just gonna be faster. What? Why is it closed now? Wait, I'm stuck in here. The doorway's closed. Hello, baby. How you doing, baby? This is a good little baby. Open the door, bitch. Get in, bitch! Close! Go up! Hello! <laughs> it wasn't that bad. I don't know. I could have done a little bit more. <laughs> I'll give it up. It was a little bit too easy. In my opinion. She's in there. I shouldn't be talking too early yet, though, because... We still got freaking Chucky's bride here, so... <laughs> Your nose, man. Might step up the game here. Oh, she's right there, brother. Unless that's a fake. Don't leave. I can't let you. I don't even have weapons. Oh, God. Oh, f oh. Try and find me. Okay. 
I can't even go in there no more. Am I supposed to follow this? No way here. Oh, you're naked. Before your friends find me. Hello. Ah, you son of a bitch. Fucking monster. Oh, piece of sh Where are you going, bitch? Oh, gosh. I do not know. I want to know what happens if... Wait for you here. Oh, hell no. I'm there. Hopefully she's not there. Blood! Ah! Oh, this gives you away pretty easily. Please don't go back downstairs. At least I hope you can't go back downstairs. Where is she? Go back here, go back here. I found her. It's usually gonna be three. No. I'm only doing this to you be because you're a f doll piece of sh Let me double check. Make sure. I go upstairs. Just in case. Where is she? You're not in there. Okay. It's because these guys are going crazy if I don't find her in time. Look at them. They're just going super crazy now. Hello there, bitch. Keep on stabbing. Who did I kill? Ah. It's over. Okay. Not bad. So where's my stuff? We'll make things right. Who's that? Ah. Good. I need to get out of this place. And before it has to be us, it has to place down the stuff. Combine with the four winky. So that's who was behind all this? Yeah, no strings. If he Donna and Angie. That's what their names are. Leg flask. Angie. Okay, am I done? Alright, I got my stuff back somehow. That was simple. <laughs> I ain't going to lie. Who knows, man? Me, I might still be alive. At the same time, Sharon and Chris would have used killing bullets, but... Sharon, you'd want to question her, right? You wouldn't fully kill her. So, can I somehow... Open this door to use a freaking thing? Examine. I need to find something for that? Let's see. God damn it, another zombie is freaking rising from the ground. Yeah, freaking new shoddy. Okay. Something new. Sun and moon ball. Ah, okay. Combine. Here we go. Photo of a strange bird. Oh, this is the ball that I need. Sun and moon ball. Hold on, don't freaking. That's a shortcut, though, right? Like, come on. Ernie. Okay. A little bit slow. And then we go like this. Okay, and it's slow. So, 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 so. So, 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 so. So, 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 so. I made it. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I got it. 
Onyx Skull. And we're gonna be rich once I get back. I'm gonna see. Ah, Luthier's key. Found it. November 10th. Mistress Dawn is now Mother Miranda's adopted daughter. In all my years, I've never been this overjoyed. Ever since childhood, she has always feared others due to the scar across her face. After her parents' death, she locked herself away and would only talk to Angie, the doll her father made her. I am forever thankful to Mother Miranda's uh, infinite compassion. November 27th. Uh, Mistress Dawn seems happy. It might be my imagination, but feeling like her doll Angie is even more lively than before. She came to me in the garden today and used Angie to talk with me. We had a mighty fight conversation. Something about receiving a gift of power from Mother? November 29th, Mistress Donna gave me yellow flowers and told me to plant them in the garden. I planted them in front of Miss Claudia's grave. I don't know if it was the sound of flowers, but I felt light-headed. Then, like a dream, I saw my departed wife. I mentioned this to Donna, and she seemed thrilled by it. She told me to go to the house tomorrow and see her. She said I could see my family once more. I'm not sure what she meant by that, but she's so kind. Hopefully you didn't die. Hello there, you fool. Look familiar to you. Yeah, not at all. Hey, I'm making 66000 Ah, Miss Angie. Just adorable. Porcelain dolls are very popular, you know. And let's go ahead and put down this other one that I need. Legs flask. Maybe I should have read it actually. Maybe there would have been some other things on it. Let me go down here because I'm pretty sure this is where the bluebird is at. Maybe somewhere up there. Oh, that's open. What is this? Broken slab. Ah, that's what I need. Wait, hold on, there is a bluebird right there. Juicy game. Exam Ava may slumber only for a short while. We got the key for this place, so use it. Thank you. What do you got in here? Happy birthday. February 27, 2017. Alright. Got some coin. Nothing in there. A guitar? I might as well know this. Is it the amount of guitars? Is I'll never forget her fifth birthday. Ah, uh, I see. 270917. Here we go. Can't believe I did not think of that. Still Harvitla. Whatever. Ooh, exciting man. F2 rifle, high capacity. Okay, let's go back here and get that treasure down here. Ah, oh, hell no. What the f guys are doing? Mini boss? What do you mean? This ain't gonna be free. Where's he? Oh, he can't get up here. I thought he could, and I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Are you backed up? Hold on. Do I have pike bombs? Ah! Fuck! And... You. Come back here, bitch. Two. Three. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Reload. I hope this isn't freaking making him invincible. Respawning is two hours later. Four, five. Be down! Finally! Giant crystal axe. God damn. I have to fight these guys too. I can finally put this thing in. <laughs> Gosh, I did not know that there was gonna be a mini boss fight. Ah, Berengario's Chalice. Thank okay. you. Gonna be making money. Alright then, ladies and gentlemen. I think that is gonna be it for today's episode. You know, we took care of our second boss right here with Donna and Angie. That was pretty quick, though. I ain't gonna lie. I mean, honestly, we did do a little bit of walking here last episode. But anyway, next episode, we're gonna go ahead and take on the next one, which I think is gonna be the sea creature. That guy. And then, obviously, the last one is gonna be the freaking Harbinger Magneto, you know. So, yeah, anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.